Yo guys, what's up? I'm I'm back after like me not uploading for a while. So that's gonna be fun. Uh, this time I'm using Pizza Tower United. Made by these guys. For the video. And if you notice, we'll actually have some money. Which I shouldn't have. Do you want to know why? I accidentally recorded and saw that I wasn't recording. And I beat Ancient Cheese. L Lap 2 style. So yeah. That sucks. But I didn't do Blood Sauce Dungeon. So. At least I started it. Noticed I wasn't recording. And then it was like, oh. Well at least I can record now. Oh, what a pain, what a pain. But hey, at least I'm recording now and, you know, my window is actually visible because I'm just using display capture. Ugh. This was way too much of a hassle to set up and I'm pretty much just going to be using display capture from now on. Because if I don't, I'm probably just going to end up messing up the recording, having to start all over again, and getting angry. Like I literally just did. This time I turned down my microphone. That way, what's it called? Uh, yeah, it, you don't hear the constant, like, hiss of my computer. From, you know, overheating and stuff. So now it's way quieter. Come on. Oh yeah, I'm playing as the Vigilante, which is basically Pepino, but he has a gun. Uh, it's probably one of my favorite characters in the Pizza Tower United mod. I know he's based off the actual Vigilante uh, playable character in the actual game that got cut. So, they did actually do some minor changes, such as Bomb, which was broken in the original game because you know he was unfinished and didn't have the bomb input so now I can use controller and throw a bomb which is very convenient for me because he can't actually break uh, metal on his own he needs the help of bomb to do it Ugh. But yeah, I turned all of my audio down in general, so should be better? I'm not sure. If you like watching this on Chromebook, then I can imagine it being way worse because Chromebook's audio levels suck. It's either like zero or a hundred, and with no in between. But eh, uh, I don't know probably for the better. Plus, I'm pretty sure YouTube has automatic closed captions, so you could probably just use that. The Vigilante has a hard time starting fast, because unlike Pepino, he doesn't have, like, a really good dash or something. Also, he has a health system. If you look right over in the top left-ish, you'll see how there's, like, a number. It says 55 right now. Where are we topping he, he collects? Um, or big top and the health will go up. So every time it gets hit, it goes down. And you'll die when you reach zero. Obvious things are obvious. Bam. Uh, oh yeah, I just got finished with uh, Keystone, so that's pretty good. I'm doing pretty well for myself. Joke at me too. I think people are here not for the stories, but uh, for the Pizza Tower gameplay. 
So yeah. I do actually really like uh, this character. It's pretty fun. Uh, I'm pretty sure like this purple guy is called Jerome. Oh no, purple guy. <gasps> For now, dead kids gasp. William Afton, no way. I know he's a pizza teller. <laughs> Dude, imagine if William Afton was actually a pizza teller. I mean, there is a FNAF level in Pizza Tower. And lap two. This doesn't have the like, traditional death I deserve the old music, but it's still pretty good. It's pretty hype too. I'm kinda curious who produced this music, because I know it isn't the normal Pizza Tower guy. That does it, it's like Christian, whatever, it's whatever. Though it still is pretty good. Treasure. Oh, almost right, that's right. So uh, that's pretty good. I got like 30 seconds. I can actually lap three if I remember correctly. I'll try for like lap 10 on a very specific level, but Yeah, definitely at this one. And then I died. <laughs> and then I died. Actually, hold up. I want to do something real quick. There we go. This will give a much better idea of how I'm doing. So now if you look in the bottom right you'll see how much I've been I've played on this save file so if I ever edit something down you'll notice that's gonna be pretty nice I guess I don't know I'm not the one watching this stuff you guys are and if you don't like it I can always change it back personally I like to have my attempts per level rather than save because one of my save files is 18 hours or, no 36 hours So, yeah. So the mods for Pizza Tower are just either very hilarious or super fun. Or both. I could review a bunch of mods for Pizza Tower. Like, when I go ahead and just look at bad itch.io games, I could do the same thing for Pizza Tower, but mods. I th I'm curious. You know what? 
What I'm gonna do is I'm probably just gonna try to say something very clippable, put it into a YouTube short. And then just, like, from this Let's Play. And then put it out of context, just put it on YouTube shorts and just see how people react. Is that, I'm kind of curious. Um, just gotta think of what to say. Is that one to be clippable, but you know, not cancelable. My first, my first idea, and my only idea, is I wrote like a joke alpha male rant when alpha males were popular. Um, about how I don't breathe air and have spent million, and was already a millionaire at the age of two. Unlike most common peasants, I, I have been, uh, what's it called? I, let me start over. All right. I, when I started my business at the age of two, I was already a millionaire in three months. Okay. I made, I made my my first million with within like two weeks of me starting my business and you want to know how I got got so much time to put in my business unlike most common peasants I didn't breathe air and by me not breathing air I could save so much time in my day all that time I did I, I spent not breathing air I was able to put straight into my business. And as you can tell right now, I am clear, clearly very successful because of it. Unlike most common peasants who don't have the drive for this, I did. And I was able, able to put ed, everything and anything, anything and everything inside my business. Most people called me a, ah, uh, what's it called? A gifted child. You know what? I kind of just want to, maybe what I'll do is, next time, I will just put it in a Microsoft Word document, record me reading it. Put like some alpha male music in the background and done I'll put Andrew Tate over it <laughs> and just call it a day because that'll be silly you know I think an Andrew Tate is very controversial I don't know any like famous funny Sigma male kind of guys I now kind of want to make a reaction video to Sigma Males. Though I think there's a much uh, more undervalued type of male than the Sigma Male. It's called the Sugma Male. Sugma Dick Male. <laughs> Sugma Dick Male. Hey, do you want to know why my Pokemon's my favorite Pokemon is Sock. Uh, here, it's a uh, Sock on these nuts. <laughs> oh god, these nut jokes are the best. Ugh. I don't get why more people don't do them. Are they offen? Are these nuts jokes offensive? I do not know. One of the great inner working mysteries of the world is these nuts offensive. When I think, when I said is these nuts offensive, all I could think of is like offensive Gen 3 Skarmory. Not that kind of offensive. Well, so that is kind of funny.
Dang it. And from the bottom. Oh god, now I'm gonna do a pizza face the whole way. Yup, and I'm dead. Yeah, screw this, I ain't doing that. Actually, hold up, I... Now I'm blue. Alright, now here's the level like an infinite lap, but I've been recording for, what is it, like, 15 minutes? Okay, yeah, I think I can fit it in. Now, Oregano Desert is actually very easy for me to near infinitely lap, so, yeah. Because, like, uh, what's it called? I've played through Oregano Desert a lot, and just kind of fun to infinitely lap. Like, hmm. It's a given that it's kind of hard, but like, after you do it like once or twice, it's pretty easy. But yeah, once you hit like the 10 lap mark, then hard mode turns on. And snick.exe comes to like kill you. Pretty sure I could turn it on right now if I wanted. I don't think I will be. But maybe, maybe next time, hmm? Next time I just have like 17 mods hard mode, I'm also blindfolded, and I'm cancelled on Twitter, all at the same time. <laughs> Actually, I don't think anybody knows my Twitter, so they can't really cancel me. That's it? That's how you don't get cancelled on Twitter? Just don't have a Twitter. How did nobody think of this? It, it was ge it's genius. You can't get cancelled on Twitter if you don't have a Twitter. Alright, so for this you actually need to bomb. Um, yeah, you can't actually transform into anything as a vigilante. He has no sprites and he's just programmed to take damage if he gets transformed. So, yeah, it's kind of broken. I kind of wish Vigilante was in the base game as like a playable character. It doesn't make sense that the only other playable character is Gustavo. And then that's it. Like, it was... Every single boss except for Fake Capino, um, if they haven't been scrapped, would have been playable in the base game. But because they uh, scrapped it, they are not playable. Um, what's it called? The most finished was the noise. Was the noise because all he was was just Pepino too. That's it. That's all he was meant to be. Oh, well, no, he started out as his own kind of original character, but then devolved into Pepino too for uh, the co-op mode. Also, this is probably one of the harder secret rooms as Vigilante.
Yep. No, I just did it first try because I'm a professional. have like actually no that this completely makes sense never mind I was gonna say why do they have I was gonna question why they had the um uh it's called alien but it makes sense because this is the desert I kind of wish they saved it for the farm level though because I felt like it would have made more sense there because you know aliens and and cows belong on a farm. I don't get why there's like a just that over there. This feels kind of random. Yep. Also, for some reason, that guy's immune to bullets. I don't know what they're putting in these sausages, but they're immune to bullets. <laughs> then you get picked by a cow. Then you run this way. video yeah I'm probably gonna end this recording after this level and just, just call it a day you know I know I hadn't done that again uh so I'm getting tired it's very late right now at 8 a.m. That's probably how I'm going to end it today. Uh, if you liked the video, I'd recommend liking, subscribing, and commenting because algorithm, blah, 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 blah. But I will see you around next time. Bye bye.